but uh, but let's uh, let's go go on with the with the with the, with the angle of view. Uh, I'm sorry, that it's uh, the black uh, text doesn't show well, but uh, but it's about the horizon and, and ivory tower. This is a lighthouse, and this, as you might know, the the, the horizon, the distance you see, uh, uh, depends pretty much on, on on how high is your eye from the from the ground, and the, the, the higher up you are, and the further you see, and the, and this is just an uh, illustrative picture that uh, from the boat uh, over there you see uh, approximately three four kilometers from the lighthouse you can see 20 and the picture is taken from aircraft so from there you see even further so the question is how far the, the horizon is uh, uh, um, and uh, and when we look at the, all the all the plans and perspectives then quite often the uh, the year 2050 is, is, is mentioned and, uh, and set as a as a as a goal or a or a or a benchmark, and uh, it's only 40 years from now. Uh, uh, and if we look at the different ambitions, then uh, recently in the published uh, plans in Denmark uh, uh, say that by 2050 the the Danish economy is fossil free, and uh, and I read another report. Uh, uh, um, by by Stockholm Environment Institute telling uh, telling office and, uh, and the partners that uh, the Baltic states also can uh, reach the same goal by then uh, if, uh, if there was not the ivory tower of business as usual. This is where we come back to the lighthouse and the and the symbol of of, of, of horizon is that uh, we are looking from the lighthouse to the horizon to, to uh, 2050. Uh, but it is a bit like the ivory tower. Uh, it is a bit of, of ignorance and that, and we too often refer to the political priorities. This is a, a picture of a, of a super tanker with all the funny pipes on it, and, and this, uh, the, it is to describe our dependency on, on the business as usual, dependency on, on oil and, and fossil fuels, and that. Uh, and political priorities that we sometimes set um, uh, uh, before uh, that uh, maybe the rational uh, um, situations that uh, I would here like to mention the, the infamous uh, Baltic Sea gas pipe that, that we know will be built there and uh, it has very very strong political uh, political uh, Context and uh, Estonia is the last country I think around this uh, uh, place who is fighting against it, and uh, they very much uh, prove that in the end of the day we are wrong in our in our assumptions. And uh, and in this uh, in this uh, context also, uh, I would like to demonstrate this uh, this uh, political um, priorities of of, uh, of not allowing uh, changes uh, into our everyday. Life. I just recently, just last week, I had a discussion in the Environmental Committee of the Estonian Parliament where the where, uh, question of oil shale mining and, 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 uh, and the mining limits was, were discussed and, uh, and then many of my colleagues said that, uh, sorry, we cannot, uh, uh, we cannot uh, afford uh, these limits because we are, well, uh, 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 we don't have an alternative, we don't have a, uh, yet to develop enough the, the the wind energy, and then I asked it who was actually uh, against this. Am I exceeding my time? Yes, I'm sorry. Then I'm, I'm trying to have the second half of my short presentation very quickly. <laughs> uh, uh, but basically, uh, um, the, uh, the, 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 the one of the matters that we have to consider is, is, is the water. Water is around us. It's, it's everywhere. Uh, this is Estonia, fifth season Soma. And this is a recent report from Estonian state uh, audit uh, where we see that uh, uh, the, uh, the contents of, of, of uh, uh, NL3 in the, in, the, in the groundwater has been oil soil, has been falling since, uh, since uh, 1989. And again, uh, here you see it's rising. This is the kind of a tolerable limit. We are getting back to the, to the, to the beyond tolerable limit and we cannot talk anymore about that. It's inherited. It is, it is uh, its presence where 
where many people have decided that they want uh, uh, bigger yields uh, from, uh, from agriculture uh, and sometimes it feels as if uh, the farmers live in limited town and, and drink bottled water. Uh, this is our common Baltic Sea, uh, where all that water that comes from the ground ends up with, uh, with a consequence of, of uh, eutrophication. Uh, this is a satellite photograph that you might have seen uh, about the, the algae blooms and, the, and all, this, all this that we, we do in our uh, farms, in our homes, will end up in a, in a common, uh, common Baltic Sea with a common agricultural policy that actually emphasizes that. Uh, the importance of agriculture, but doesn't uh, mention always the importance of, of environment. We lose biodiversity. Baltic Sea is really poor compared to the world ocean, and every organism, every uh, life form we lose in the, in the, in the Baltic uh, may be irreversible. Uh, we need sustainable fisheries for it is uh, the sea who, uh, that feeds us for, for, uh, for fish and uh, and we need the integrated sea use management. We need to understand that there is no borders in the common, common world anymore. Uh, we, we are sharing the same sea, so it should be for the whole Baltic Sea. And uh, the logo down there shows that we have uh, joined the Convention of, of, uh, of Protection of Species and Habitats. Lifestyle. Quickly, about lifestyle. <laughs> Uh, there is um, there is an energy mark, you know, on, on refrigerators and, and and washing machines, and uh, and Finland has developed a similar energy uh, uh, mark for for cars, and the, the black arrow there shows that, that 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 is the kind of sustainable amount of uh, not sustainable but the tolerable amount of CO2 that we can emit uh, from our cars. Just keep an eye on that and, and look at this. This is a, a recent study of, of Estonian. Um, Kind of transport uh, working group where you can see that uh, that uh, the EU uh, average is 140, that is around uh, mark D, and all except Denmark, we all are here. We are above the the, the mark. That is something about uh, uh, that we have to we have to uh, think about when we. Uh, do our our uh, consuming uh, uh, decisions, and this is uh, again sorry about the black. Uh, there it's the we learn as a go thing with a limited resource we have here, <laughs> and with a ability we have here, we have to we have to you know uh, solve the situation that we are facing, and uh, so I think uh, in this matter, in this aspect of of of, uh, of cooperation. Uh, Human capital is key to solutions. Uh, the, the education, knowledge, and and, uh, and sharing the knowledge is, is, is extremely important. That's uh, that's the key to survival, and uh, and we have to to openly share the uh, the, the best uh, uh, knowledge and, the, and, and projects to carry them to life. And uh, so I, I would like here just to mention this uh, one of what, a very good examples is the Interred Central Baltic program, which has. Uh, has uh, uh, carried out um, uh, environmental education in, in, in Estonia and, 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 uh, and neighboring uh, areas, and now it's working on food safety and, uh, and uh, scientific data integration. So, so these are, uh, these are uh, I think, key issues to the, to the, um, to the region development. And um, cooperation is the solution, as you can know, always uh, know from ants and, uh, and uh, if we come back to the lifestyle, it's the freak and share kind of thing. That, that, that uh, uh, it is a it is a strategy proposed by by many many uh, um, uh, thinkers on on how we can uh, fit ourselves into the frames of this uh, of this planet. Uh, this is about uh, this is about uh, uh, the ecological footprint. This is about the uh, cars. Uh, uh, Energy saving, of course, is, is uh, the, the fifth fuel. It's the, it's the easiest to achieve, it's cheapest to, to, to use. Uh, so I think that is, uh, that is important in the cooperation also that, that, that we share and, and encourage all the projects related to energy efficiency. Water management, as I showed, water is a, is a, is a limited resource also if we are ignorant uh, and uh, look for, for economical benefits, then we will quickly lose uh, some of the environmental security. Uh, 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 
traffic planning, again, lifestyle and, and public uh, transport, I think that is e extremely important to, to cooperate in these matters, like uh, would it be trans-European uh, railways or would it be uh, 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 urban planning that, uh, that, uh, that would uh, save uh, lots of... Uh, and electricity interlinks, that comes back to the, to the village islands uh, where, we, where we walked before. And uh, I would like, as a politician, a politician, to say and emphasize that political borders work only for a short time. The 20th century is over. We have to uh, look on the, on the world in a, in a bit uh, wider matter. And I'm sorry for exceeding my time, but I think that this uh, slide describes our future quite well. The younger generation has to work together uh, to use the simple means to gather the energy from the, from the environment. And uh, whether they feed a horse or, or or make electricity from it, uh, it is uh, for them to decide. Thank you for your attention. And, uh